Hey guys, Cobra here. Welcome to another day on the Free Brew account. Day 126, guys, picked up that four star chicken. And guys, we've got some news for today. Lots of news, and especially this, guys. We go on the missions, we see that no, <laughs> the Arbiter mission is no more our sole purpose. We're gonna go be going for this guy right here. So, I mean, Arbiter will be like a cool mission to finish, but now we've got so many more to do and so many more things to focus on and this will be the continuation to our free to play journey so i'm happy about that so we've got dungeons 25 to finish um i think there's lots of great whole bonuses that you need to do which now that i think of it it might be what's gonna cause me to not get this champion uh because like i was having an idea of the free account kind of doing like lots of stuff passing through the missions but now it dawned on to me that i need to reach gold one in in 3 3 arena i need to do i think lots of faction was 21 and i need to pick up many um i need to do many great holes at level 10 which is a lot of grind and i don't have that kind of time unfortunately like i haven't even finished my my first one just yet and they're not gonna introduce any kind of system to make this faster anytime soon um so maybe this will not uh, an achievable goal like in under a year i think i won't be able to do this before christmas there's no way there's no way i can farm uh more great hole bonuses that fast right i mean i can get unless i'm i go immediately to um to gold four and then even even if i get like all the wins i think it's possible anyway guys we've got the clan v clan going um, our clan guys, the Brewskis, we are actually fighting head to head with this underworld underworld clan, uh, the one that's against us. Uh, we're doing our best. I'm currently ranked fourth here. Um, I'm getting as many points as I can. There's many of us also just fighting and doing our best. Um, the enemy clan has some that do like a lot of points and some that don't do anything. So it's always like these in all clans. Hopefully, um, by the time this finishes, I'll, unfortunately, I'll be going to bed, so um, it's gonna be close. But I'm I'm like fighting on both my main account and my uh, and my free to play account. So I did end up picking up all the milestone rewards. Uh, there were some of you saying that if you get the uh, energy rewards, they will go to the mailbox. I, I believed you guys, and you probably just trolled me. Uh, the The energy did not go to my mailbox. It went immediately right here. So I had to use it and leveled up stuff. So I, I didn't really mind, but um, I, I thought you guys liked me. So uh, if you want to prove me wrong, just click that like, but like button at least. Okay. So uh, only the XP boost go here, guys. Only the XP boost go here, and the uh, and the arena refresh goes here from the clan v clan rewards. Everything else, um, like energy, goes in here. So the brews the silver everything goes right into your account while the xp boost and the arena refresh doesn't so dungeons 25 the next thing in our list guys i'm gonna be using this energy that i had i was gonna save this 200 plus the other 200 for the future that's coming on tuesday but i said whatever i'll just use gems instead it just means you know about 60 gems or so uh that i'm losing here um I'll show you where I'm at in dungeons, 25. I've started with one of the dungeons. And uh, yeah, I just want to tell you one thing about Arena. I've been in and out of gold about four times today. To uh, 1950 to, to, to 2050. Back and forth. About, about four times today. I just want to say that I keep getting attacked. Fully, look at all these attacks in a row. Look at all these. Look at this hegemon teams attacking me the russians and uh been fighting my way back okay doing my best you can see it from the silver medals that i have like lots of silver medals my gold medals have slowly been increasing but i need 901 more <laughs> until my gray hole so it's a grind always so dungeons 25 you guys know that we've got the new arcane keeps all the new potion keeps okay these are great because these actually give you a greater potion and a superior potion those are i mean it's a good it's a good change. It's you see it. It's no more lesser potions. I've had enough. Okay, Plarium, and they 
They said, okay, we'll do that for you. No Minotaur 20, unfortunately, which would have been nice, honestly. I mean, even if the energy is higher and it ends up costing the same in terms of gems, if it's faster, I'll, I'll still be happy with that. If it if it costs the same. So we do have Ice Golem, Spider, Fire Knight, and Dragon's Lair. Um, I only try Dragon's Lair. And the, all the other ones, there's no rush in me trying to do the 25s. Um, I could try and do them just for the completion of them. But um, especially Fire Knight. Fire Knight will be impossible because of the Terminator reduction. That's that's not really possible there to do the Terminator reduction. I don't have a lore. And also it's 12 shields instead of instead of 10. So look at this, guys. I'm at stage 25. Haven't even tried it yet. So this is Force Affinity. So ideally, I would be using a Spirit Poisoner. I don't have a Spirit Poisoner. I don't have the majority of my team being Spirit. What I do have is a Force Poisoner. This was the team that I used until 23. 24, I used Frozen Banshee because she was strong affinity. She wouldn't get hit. Uh, and now I'll be using this team. I think this should be just fine. It's just way longer. This is my thought on the new dungeons, guys. They're just way longer. Okay. Um, it's it's just a grind. You reach the boss. It's the same kind of thing. It, it, they haven't changed anything to the way the whole thing works. It's just a little bit stronger. You need an attack down. Even with the attack down, look at all the damage that I'm taking. Like here, um, I think if I don't pass the waves, I'll probably need like a stun. Something that stuns, maybe Basilisk, um, maybe um, Fellhound in a stun set could be used here instead of Saito. Saito gives nothing here. Uh, the damage that he does is nothing compared to what Althar does. Althar does more damage with the poisons than what Saito does. So, I, I mean, here I could have used anything, even... I would say instead of Saito, I could have used um, even High Katoon. I could have used High Katoon here. I could have used Grush. Grush is an amazing champion. Um, I've got, he's still five star, but I've, I've got um, Under Priest Brogni, so I can use him. He is weak affinity here, but still he's a good support here. He has an HP burn. It's going to help with the damage. Compared to what Saito does, Saito just just slowly pokes them. But look at look at the damage that we're doing. So uh, a minute and a half in, and we still only finished one of the enemy uh, ads here. It's all on auto, but it's the poisons that are taking that are actually doing the damage. So man, <laughs> it's taking so long. Um, I will not be farming twenty five if this takes like eight minutes per run compared to my three minutes that I'm doing twenty. It doesn't make sense. Like even for a free to play account with the energy that I have as a free to play, I'll be farming all night to do like, let's say 800 energy compared to a couple of hours. It doesn't make sense. I know the odds and stuff of getting six star legendary is way higher on 25. It's almost double, but it's a six star legendary. Like I, I'm not at a point where my only upgrades will be six star legendaries. My my Iron Brago has still common items on his on his uh, gloves, I think. So he still has room to upgrade without needing only six star legendaries. So uh, once we finish this wave, I'll check on wave two. I can't remember what wave two is. I haven't even done twenty five on my main account yet. Um, spider, uh, I have done Spider twenty five, but haven't done Dragon twenty five on my main account on the normal server i've done it on the test server but i did use seer and and lydia which i didn't even care what the waves were so these waves yeah i just remember these waves have shatter bones shatter bones is very annoying if he's not somehow controlled so you'll see what he does and okay so the provoke is out we won't have it for another two turns you guys will see what kind of damage he does and control. He does a lot of control and terminator reduction. Shattered Bones does. So here we didn't stun Shattered Bones. There's a block cooldown skills on one of them. That's cool. Not controlling them. I just want to see how this team does. There's the first death. There's ah, we didn't do the provoke. Look at all that terminator reduction, okay? Good thing is we do have a reviver. Got security. Three turns cooldown. Um, there it is. 
even refresh our cooldown there. That's good. Um, here, Saito, it just takes all the pain. So the next, the next Shadow Bones that gets a turn, he's going to do the same thing. That decreasing Terimeter and AoE attack. It's pretty hard hitting attack. Well, he's level 350, but still, it's a, it's a pretty hard hitting attack. So, like on this account, like my wish list for Cold Heart has gone down, actually. Like, I don't need Cold Heart anymore on this account since she won't help me as much as other champions would. So, now, like Mordecai, who I used for Broken Fusion, became top of my list for Spider 25. And uh, Mordecai helps, I think, in other dungeons as well. Like, the HP burn will be useful, term to reduction. Um, who else has become top of my list in terms of in terms of epics? Allure, Allure is great. Um, I think for Ice Golem, I'm fine with Ice Golem. I've got the decrease attacks. I've got poisoners. Um, I think with just a slow team, ten minute runs, I should be doable. But uh, yeah, this seems doable. I'll just skip right to the boss. So guys, we're at the boss. We already started, um, you know, attacking the boss. This boss hits hard. So we do need to land a decrease attack on the big dragon. Uh, we seem to not be landing it with Iron Brago. Hopefully I can get his accuracy a little bit higher because it seems that he's not landing it. I think I need about 250 for, for me to be, um, to be beating this. So, okay, we've got the defense up. I think that's, that's okay, but isn't the drag, doesn't the dragon ignore defense somehow? I swear, I swear he had something like this. Anyway, his damage just scales up as the fight goes on. But if you've got a poisoner, this becomes like an easy fight. I think this will be like a nine minute, nine minute fight. Come on, work those poisons, Althar. <laughs> um, I swear, you just need a poisoner here uh, on dragon and a way to be tanky. That's it. I'm at my cat just stole my glasses. <laughs> um so we're eight minutes 20 seconds yeah it's gonna be under under nine minutes this is cool okay what are we gonna get if i get it a five star air i swear okay six uh no five star epic we get 75 points eight and a half minutes guys for stage 25 we get an attack percent lifesteal boot which is worthless um, to be honest with those substats, no crit rate. So <laughs> I sold it 4 million dealt by Althar. Look at Saito's damage, 333,000, um, definitely can be replaced by somebody else in my next run. Uh, I mean, I would have done who would have been a better choice here. I mean, even, even Painkeeper would have been a better choice. She's got an AOE decreased cooldowns heal. She's very, very fast. So she can be taking tons of turns. Uh, Doom Priest would be so nice here. When she gets the uh, level 60, uh, who else will be great here once I get them? I mean, um, Maniter wouldn't be so great here. I mean, even Hikatoon would have given me a lo lots of speed, getting a lot of turns, but she wouldn't be helping so much with damage. She would be helping maybe with Terminator Reduction, but um, definitely like a solid choice. She would have been a solid choice. So yeah, Iron Brago needs a little bit more accuracy. 184 accuracy doesn't cut it for, for dungeons anymore. Um, I'm in no rush in upgrading my Iron Brago. And the reason is I'm not using Iron Brago anymore. You guys know uh, that I've changed my clan boss team recently. And that's why, oh, I didn't show you. I did get a sacred shard today, guys. Um, I have the screenshot on my Discord server. If you're still not a member of my Discord server, like I post these kind of stuff, like my loot, if I open the loot, I post it, and it's good. I post it in the Brewskis. There's, we've got like a Brewskis channel for my own clan, so it's cool if you want to check it out and and be and be there when that happens. So I've got 194 energy. The remaining of the day, I'll get some. Um, I wanted to get some more level 30s, so I'll get some more level 30s going, uh, so I can get some more five stars and get my next six star, which I need to do it to. Well, tomorrow, and if I don't do it tomorrow, I'll need to do it by next Wednesday, which is a, a, a long way to go. So the reason that I'm saying tomorrow is because I need to do force keep 10 times tomorrow. Um, well, I can do the force keep, okay. 
and then the ascension can be done until Sunday. And then Sunday, I need to do the void key. So this has to be done before Sunday finishes because I need to do the void key and I'm not going to pay for the void key. So the next couple of missions, some of these are retroactive. All the other ones, I'll need to do them on the day that they start. So that's cool. So guys, uh, to be closing off, uh, I'll be just finishing off my uh, Ultra Nightmare run. I think I've done two keys today, about 25 million average. Uh, it's gonna do one more key and do the 26 million there and be on the through three key territory. So this was the video for today, guys. Thanks a lot for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. And guys, I'll see you in the next one. See ya.